Hey guys, welcome to another video. So today we're going to be trying something new. We're going to be looking at stocks and analyzing stocks in 60 seconds or so. It's going to be a new series I'm going to be doing where I'm literally going to be looking at a stock for six seconds, give you my initial thoughts on the company, um, three reasons why I like it, three reasons why I don't, and then overall thoughts. Today we're going to be looking at Argo blockchain. Let's get on with it. So this is my new series where I'm going to be looking at stocks in rapid succession. So today we're going to be looking at Argo blockchain. We're going to be looking at what the company is, three reasons why I like it, three reasons why I don't, and my overall thoughts on it. It's quite, uh, you know, just a fast paced uh, look at a stock. You know, you shouldn't purchase it on any of this information. But yeah, it's just a quick look at Argo blockchain. So here it is in 60 seconds or so. So what is the company? It's a crypto mining company that predominantly mines Bitcoin and Zcash and has a market cap of 641 million pounds. In essence, it mines the cryptocurrencies in the crypto space. That's what it is as a company. It mines them, does the calculations. So three reasons why I like it. I really like uh, Peter Wall, the CEO. I think he's very transparent. He recently did a Q&A, which I thought was very interesting for April this year. So go check that out on YouTube. It has a green mining pool, uh, the Terra pool, which is where they have uh, formed a JV with another crypto mining company to mine um, cryptocurrencies uh, ethically through renewable sources. And they have a trading facility in Texas, uh, which they just purchased this year, which will be in operations next year. And it has a capacity of 800 megawatt watts, which is loads. So they can ramp up the capacity of their um, operation. Three win reasons why I don't like it. So it's potentially overvalued to 10x uh, sales. So essentially it's trading at 10 times its sales, which isn't very good. Cash flow, it isn't selling any of its holdings. So it isn't selling uh, Bitcoin and Zcash at the moment, which means its cash flow is very low. Uh, in the long run, I think that's good, but it, um, you know, its cash flow position, it has to issue new shares potentially if it wants to do anything um, and it's volatile it's a very volatile share so in the last month it had a 30% dip which wasn't ideal for investors let's be honest uh, but yeah it can go up 10% in a day but it can also come down 10% in a day so take your poison uh, overall thoughts I actually really like uh, Peter's uh, long-term view in a recent Q&A he said uh, I'm thinking in quarters and years, not months and days. I think that's what every long-term investor kind of wants to think is, is the company thinking long-term? Um, you know, I think it's a little overvalued right now and it's very tied to Bitcoin. Um, so, well, it should be tied to Bitcoin, but Argo doesn't seem to be. But in essence, it's tied to the fate of Bitcoin. Whereas if we have a very uh, sudden crash in the crypto space and Bitcoin plummets you know, right the way back down to the, the single thousands, Argo will be in trouble. Um, however, I'm actually really welcoming Argo as a, kind of a diversity play into my portfolio. It's uh, giving me exposure to the, the crypto space. And I think some interesting other points, which I didn't mention in the reasons why I like it, it has a 25% um, stake in Pluto Assets, which is a company which is looking at DeFi. Um, and yeah, it's a really interesting company overall. I really like the CEO. Uh, please do your own research into them. Um, they had a 30% dip, so it could be a time to buy some more shares, or I would personally wait if I was entering this company new, I would uh, wait until it was underneath the one pound mark. That's where I would wait. However, that's just my opinion, guys. What do you think of Argo Blockchain? Let me know in the comments down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So guys, what did you think? Um, it's a bit of an interesting format, but I thought I'd just let you know my views on Argo. Uh, if you're an investor in Argo, let me know down below or what your thoughts are on the company as a whole. Um, I think as of today, Bitcoin fell back down to uh, 55,000, which, you know, it's, it's part of the game, part of the game. But anyway, let me know down below your thoughts on Argo blockchain. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like and let me know what else I can do next. I'm going to be trying to do one of these, um, I guess, once or twice a week. So stay tuned.